What's up, guys? 8.30 a.m. So ripped up and tired from that shit. So funny, I woke up and I'm just getting the vlog posted and Conrad's just writing me on Facebook. You hungry? He's right there. He's right there. <laughs> so I'm about to get up and get this day started and uh, see what has in store. Good morning. Hope you're having a good one. And uh, I'm glad you're here with me. So another good one. Uh, this is that Gansett cre crepe lifestyle. Yo, I used to work at TJ's Ice Cream in Ocean City. I was the master of the crepe. I only made like six of them though, because no one ever ordered them. <laughs> got a message from Caden Day. Nub inspired breakfast. Your vlogs are amazing and I aspire to be like you. Keep up the good vibes as you help out myself and many other people. What's up Caden? Hope you're doing well. Breakfast looks on fleek and uh, thanks for writing in dude. I appreciate the fuck out of you. Sean Bonavita. Hey Ben, I've been watching your vids for super long and I recently got a concussion and might be out of surfing for six months. How did you deal with not surfing when you hurt and what did you do in your time when you hurt your knee besides watching a lot of TV? Because I can't do that because my eyes are all screwed up from the concussion. What's up, Sean? Sorry to hear about that. Um, what I did, I when I was hurt, I kind of, I had to spend, you know, seven weeks on the couch. You know that. So I kind of just slowed down my life and I appreciated the time that I could spend with my mom at the house and my sister and the animals at the house. And I kind of just like indulged in like the very, very simple things. You almost have to shut your mind off and just kind of not ignore the fact that you're hurt, but just kind of embrace the ability of like not responsible for a normal life. Like just be like, okay, this is the situation I've been given. This is what I've been handed and I can deal with this. And in time, it's going to fit up uh, in time. It's going to be better and I'm going to get my life back. But right now I have to hang out, be patient, appreciate what you have and just relax. And, uh, I don't watch TV anyway. So <laughs> I, I watched uh, a bunch of the office, but other than that, I did not watch any TV. So like, through my injury, I worked on my computer a lot though, so I'm sure you probably can't do that either, but keep writing me on Instagram. I'll definitely talk to you. Occupy some of your time. Thanks for watching. Thanks for writing, and uh, I hope you feel better, Sean. Damn. So my phone's been dying a lot. I was wondering why. I've had my stopwatch running for 45... Wait, what did we decide on? Hours. hours. 45 hours. <laughs> what the fuck? Winning Gansett. Oh, I got you boot. I got you seven mil boots. Oh, dude, that was gnarly. Ah. Ah. Oh. A little much, I think. Check out these headphones Conrad gave me. House of Marley, nice as fuck. Cause this cat decided to chew through mine. <laughs> uh, I was over those things anyway. These are fucking sick. Thanks, dude. And now we're going to the surf shop. To get blessed. Now we're gonna find some surf. It's 80s as fuck in this, this car. Guy. Look at that guy. Is this you? It's Peter Pan shop. Oh, is it? Yeah. Back. Word. Yeah, juice. Hey! How you doing? Uh, I got you a pair of gloves. Alright! And I got him. Uh, funny, yeah. believe it or not. That's the shit. Yeah. 250 is good. Yeah. Wendy's. You're saying so much that part of the nose of the board. I was trying to turn it down, but oh, whatever. Sense. It don't matter. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks to Narragansett Surf and Skate. I got a pair of 7 mil boots for when we go to Maine. And... I got hit with a little reality check and a little bit of appreciation in my life right now because I just looked at these and they're fucking $75. I can't even believe Hyperflex sends me so many pairs of boots. So, very appreciative right now. For the boys! We're stoked. Dropping Tide. Heavy sash. <laughs> Live fast, eat mayo. Thank you very much. Yeah. 
<laughs> what was the problem there? Some douchebag was in the way. <laughs> I went chicken salad straight up. All right, uh, we just got out. Had a bunch of fun out there on the point break. I actually surprised myself, and I was surprised by the surf. Conrad surprised me with his skills, though. And uh, we're gonna head back to his house real quick, and then see if we can get another session going. Rhode Island, it's about two, three foot. Super fun, pretty windy, but uh, we're getting it, and uh, it's been good. See what the rest of the afternoon has to offer us. Maybe two surf sessions, that'd be amazing. I like this. 5 p.m. <sighs> Sesh on. This guy puts a speaker on top of his car and throws the Rolling Stones on to get pumped to go out. Let's see what it's all about. How stoked are you? Mildly stoked. <laughs> How stoked would you be if you didn't have the boombox? Boombox is like 80% of the stuff, man. <laughs> Yo. All right, we're back. We're about to go surf again. The wind kind of came on shore, but waves are way bigger. So I'm claiming one backside rotator under the lip, though, because I know I can't. Tube inside a tube inside a tube. I know I can't get projection out there, so I'm just going to do tubes and one wave. pretty much a backside chop tube, hop, but backside chop hop, but everyone's going to think that it's a backside air three. All right. Kyle. Yeah. surfing but we went out and got pizza did a bunch of shit but 
it's pretty late now and uh, about to go to sleep so um, see you guys in the morning bright and early for drinking coffee and talking shit thank you so much for watching I appreciate the fuck out of each and every one of you and uh, waves in the morning so mm.